Hey guys, this is Maverick427 and welcome back to Sid Meier's Civilization 6. We are gonna go to the next turn. So our trader is busy making his way over to Muscat. Um, the barbarians apparently have a slinger and they're attacking... who's this? I think one of Muscat's warriors. We're busy building a settler because we want to settle over here. But first we need to get rid of these barbarians. Mm, these guys are taking a long time to do their turn. Don't know what that's about. Okay, so scout. Keep scout. Ooh. Yeah, we found our first goodie hut. So this is a tribal village. They start off on the map. And if your scout goes onto them, they're destroyed and you get a bonus. We're not destroyed, they're used up. We're peaceful explorers, not conquerors. Okay, so let's come over here. Let's come and peacefully explore these barbarians. So we found a goody hut. Isn't so cute. No, there's actually fish and fish and deer. This is a good place to settle another city. And lots of food. Ah, okay, these guys a thing. Now we can just kill this thing straight away so I'm gonna do that. So otherwise it's gonna attack us each turn and do damage and that won't be nice. And by killing barbarians we've boosted bronze working. You go. Ah okay so he got a promotion. That was the bonus we got this time. Looks like there's what is this a mountain? Mountain. Uh, so we've got tick boosted, new continent. Oh, we discovered a new continent. Okay, so we're on... This is Euro-America. And we started on Kazakhstania. Interesting. We got a promotion. We did this. So we've got Aero score for doing that as well. Which is nice. Okay, first things... Oh, you need orders. Okay. Now we can go next turn. Uh, these guys are going to come here and attack our stinger. First things first. Burn it all. Hey, we got irrigation. Nice. And you can attack these guys. So let's see, what promotions do we have? Fast movement on hills or fast movement on the rainforest? So what do we have here? We have hills and rainforest. Hills. Rainforest. You know, there's a lot of rainforest, but there's also a lot of hills. So let's get the hills. Okay, two areas score for clearing out this thing. What are we on now? We are on... 7 out of the 11 we needed to avoid the Dark Age. Yeah, there's nothing else we can really do this turn. We need to kill this guy. Oh, please don't tell me he's going to go kill our trader. That would suck. Oh, she's happy at, because I killed some barbarians. Well, that's good. Okay, luckily he's attacking our slinger instead of looting our trader, which would suck. Okay, scout, keep scouting. You have a promotion. Plus five rain strength seems really good. And I'm gonna come over here and help protect our stinger. And you can already see, like, faintly, our trader's busy making a road. Without craftsmanship, inspiration is a mere reed shaken in the wind. Okay, I think I'm going to leave both of these in. Like, we've got two new ones. Production towards cavalry. Oh no, anti-cavalry. And... 
production towards boulders, but we're not doing either of those at the moment, so... Eh. And you can just kill this guy. And I actually want you to come here and sit on the tower where we want to put our village, our city. Steam hisses from the ground here. Right. Okay, okay, thank you. Okay, so we found a barbarian scout. We found a geothermal vent somewhere. I don't know where. Oh, there it is. Yeah, so geothermal vents give us science. And way, way in the future, we can get energy from that. And we met Taruga. We were not the first city-state to meet them, so we didn't get an envoy. Uh, okay, none of these we're going to do anytime soon. Let's meet you. So let's see what civics we can have. Uh, let's go a bit more slowly. So I, I just want to get to this as soon as possible. We're not going to roll a special district just yet, so let's do this one. Maybe we get to 6 population and get this boost. So that's why I'm doing that one second, to give us time to grow population. Probably not, because the settler is going to eat up one of our population. Oh well. Okay, you are going to heal. You are going to... I guess explore this way. Yeah, I think somewhere on this coast would be a nice place to settle as well. Like if I go over here, if I go here, it's one, two, three to get the spices. Although he is also one, two, three away, so he'd get it before we do probably. Uh, maybe further to the south here, there's a place to settle. We'll see. Ooh, goody hut. Goody heart. Okay, new plan. You're not gonna just sit there. You're gonna go find the. You're gonna get to the goody heart. You get better bonuses if a scout gets it, but our scout's on the other side of the map, so he's not gonna get it. It's like a rock here. Nice. Ah, oh, balls. Lost our trader. Barbarians killed our trader. That is garbage. Can we buy another one? No, we don't even have money for a trader. Great. Okay, you go get this. Ooh, okay, so we discovered a new secret society, the Void Singers. A physician without a knowledge of astrology has no right to call himself a physician. Ah. Uh, the villagers gave us a boost towards astrology. I don't know how much we had left, but it made us finish it this turn. And they gave us knowledge of the wheel. Nice. Wheels are good. Everyone loves wheels. Okay. Uh, let's, now let's get writing. And as soon as we finish the settler, we're going to build... We're going to try to build Stonehenge. And you're going to keep... It, uh, now, but th this clan is far away. I think we can mostly ignore them. Like, it'll take them a long, long time to send anything around here to bother us, so... That's probably fine. Oh, and we're gonna have another marble. Nice. And that's an error score for getting the goody hut. Nice. Vietnam founded a city. Okay, let's go find this barbarian who broke our stuff. And kill him. And you can go sit there and protect our... ...spot. Gott grüße euch, Geselle. Ich bin Kaiser Friedrich und herrsche über Deutsche und Welsche Lande, über Burgund und manche mehr. Ich weiß wohl, dass auch ihr Kund geherrschen mit rechter Gewalt. Okay, we met uh, Frederick Bar Barbosa of Germany. It's an honor to meet you. I would love to sample your hospitality. Here's your capital. 
That is a German settler. If I declare war, do I get your settler? Well, we'll see next turn, because I don't have to move in to grab it now. And it might just get taken by the scout, in which case my scout can kill his scout and get it back. But I think if you steal a settler, it just turns into a worker. I don't think it's completely broken. Ah, okay, okay, okay. So, we have a bunch of stuff going on. We can found a pantheon. Okay, let's come and look at our lands. So, there are a lot of things we can do here. Okay, tundra tiles, we don't tundra. We have a little bit of desert here, so this might be good. Uh, how do you start next rivers? Eh. See, this one is good early, but then it kind of falls off later. Fishing boats is maybe a good one because we're going to have one, two, maybe like a bunch of fishing boats from all of these fish here. What is that? God of the Sea. God of the Sea might be good because we're coastal, but it doesn't give us anything right now. Desert floodplains, marsh, and oasis. Do we have one oasis. I don't know if we have any desert floodplains or marshes. No, there's a marsh. Is that a marsh? No, that's a grasslands. Okay, we don't have marshes. There's the marsh. Uh, those are good. Camps, quarries. That's stone. I think marble is me is done with a mine. Yeah, you need mining for it, okay? Yeah, see, faith from mines. So we get two faith from these. I think this takes mining as well. So we would have like six faith if. Ooh, bonus resources as well, because these are bonus. If we set out here, we get one, two. We don't get the copper. Uh, Muscat would get it regardless. Uh, plantations. Initiation rights. This would have been good if we still had barbarians to kill, but we don't. Honestly, I think we take God of the Sea, because I think that's going to be the best one long term. It's either that or Religious Idols. So it's going to be six faith. It's going to be one, two, maybe like four or five production from God of the Sea. I want to take religious idols. Yeah, we founded our first pantheon. So over time, uh, we can get a great profit, which adds two beliefs with a full religion. And yeah. So what do we have here? You are going to find that stupid ass who destroyed our place. Okay, here's our other option. Do we just declare war with him, steal his settler, and then uh, try and peace out as soon as we can? I think we do. Wie wollt ihr an mir gesiegen, der ich so viel der Fiende verdorbe? Yeah, 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 good for you. Bugger off. I'm gonna steal your shit. Oh, it turns into a settler. It actually turns into a settler. Okay. That is so good. That is actually so good. Now the question is where to settle. So if I settle like here, like it's jests. We don't have fresh water. Uh, 
can, can you okay you can't move this turn so i'm gonna just link you two and skip your turn for now so that the links they'll move together okay we got this for a pantheon we've declared war mysticism okay so when find the city you want to try and settle on fresh water like a river salt water is almost as good but there's no fresh water on this side of the map so i'll probably i think i'm going to settle there like it's suggested so what we saw this stone because this one one two three we could try and steal the spice from taruga And this is also more defensible. And then we get one, two fish. One, two, three. Yeah, we get the deer if we settle there. We get the stone. Two stone, actually. One, two, three. Plus this deer. You know what? I think that's the spot. And there's sheep right next to it. Yeah. That's the spot. And Germany has to deal with barbarians, so... Hey, no, 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 bugger off. Don't attack our scout. Okay, you are going to come... Yeah, so I can either settle here or here. Which of these is better? Hang on, that's the question. So both these are fresh water. So this is okay. I'm going to use one of the mods I installed. Radio measuring tool. Uh, how do I use this thing? Ah, okay. So can I move you off to the? Okay, it just stays in the way there. That's better. So if I settle there, I get two fish, I fish the crabs, the horses, the mercury, and one wheat, uh, one maize, one wheat. If I settled here, yeah, I get an extra wheat if I settled here. Okay. Thank you, radio measuring tool. We are going over here. Also, that land would flood if the sea level rises, so might not be the safest play. And you, I want you to go over there. So. Oh. Stonehenge needs to be adjacent to stone. Huh. Can we buy anything? Can buy another. I think I'm actually going to buy the boulder first because the boulder is going to allow us to build stuff. And I'm going to start with a holy site. No, I'm not because there's no good spot for it. Uh, maybe yeah actually yes I'm gonna put it there it's gonna remove the woods it's fun then as our city expands we're gonna have a really good place for our campus there and in nine turns we're gonna have a holy site and we can start founding a religion hopefully okay I have no idea where the stupid barbarian went I think it was killed by muscat Yep, keep keep walking. Actually, I want you to come this way again. Because if we get attacked by Germany, which is very unlikely, we're going to need people here to defend us. Okay, so let's come here. And next turn we're going to use our boulder to improve things. He's going to make a quarry. It's going to be awesome.
Vietnam also has found a pantheon now, based on fertility rights. Cool, good for them. May they be fertile and have lots of babies. Okay, so this is our worker. He has three charges, as you can see, which means he can build three things. You can see there's three of them. So I'm gonna build a quarry here. Yeah, and oh, I've just realized something. We don't get faith because it's a quarry, not a mine. That sucks. Hopefully that one's a mine. Okay, so I should have gone for the fish in the end. That was a mistake, but hey, we live and we learn. At least we've got a boost to masonry for making a quarry. Yeah, you can, I don't know, work your way to, like, there. I forgot what to do with you then, and you do the same. You, like, can't head, head this way, somewhere there. As for you, you are going to... The Mogadishu's warrior standing in the place I want to improve. Hopefully he moves. Because our settler to settle things. He is not moving. So I'll come here instead. Writing is easy. All you have to do is cross out the wrong words. Okay, yeah. So I guess I didn't really explain this when I started building it, but the holy site's a district. Districts take up one of your tiles. You can see it sits there instead of giving like food and this stuff now. It's going to give us faith when it's built. Because this is next to a mountain, we get one faith. If it was next to another um, district, it would give us an additional faith. So I'm going to put a campus district here later. Districts are unique. You can only have one per s one of that district per city. And I think you can have a maximum of three districts in your city if you below 10 population. And then as your population increases, you can add more districts. Anyway, to a boulder, let's build a farm. And now let's also look at what our dudes are doing. Okay, so you, yeah. So I want you there. I want you to continue doing this. And that is a good tile, so we'll do that one. Uh, and since we have the spice near us, let's get irrigation. You're still in my way. I'm gonna set my boulder over here because I wanna improve this as soon as we settle our city. A strong economy begins with a strong, well educated workforce. Okay, so let's see here. Let's go double. XP for recon units because we're not fighting barbarians at the moment and I kind of just want to keep earning faith for now and plus one gold is nice we don't have trade routes it got destroyed can we buy another trade yet how much is a trader 185 okay in like 11 turns we can do that lovely screw you barbarians So we want to get to here as soon as we can. So we're going to do early empire and then political philosophy. Six populations. So we have three here. We're going to have a fourth one here. 
and a fifth one when we found the city and then this one's going to grow to four there so i think we'll actually have six in a few turns so we will get this eureka and we've got another governor title so either we can join these things so let's see each trade route sent to a city state awards an envoy there now as you construct the old god obelisk a powerful replacement for the monument I don't know if I want to do either of these at the moment but I will promote Pingula because more science per turn for each citizen is good so we have three guys in the city we have four science it's going to jump us straight up to seven which should update the start of next turn and we can now found our second city our people have chosen to create a city along the low coast within the sound of the ocean's waves but this is lowland and will flood if the sea level right okay thank you okay we founded a city on the coast next to a river and we got a eureka for sailing because we found it on the coast lovely neck hen very egyptian sounding and you, uh, hmm. What are we going to do with you? We can't build Stonehenge. We have a marsh town, apparently, we can put this on. Where's the marsh town? Oh, this is a marsh. Okay. I'm not going to actually buy that because it's going to take 62 turns to do. I think we okay so we have a problem already we have minus one amenities so amenities you get them from luxury resources and if you had zero or minus one it's okay but below that it's gonna make your population unhappy they're gonna build stuff slower they're gonna grow slower it's just gonna be a bad time uh, so we need to start getting these luxury resources like made which is why our workers coming over here so i'm just going to go for a granary i think because plus one food plus two housing seems good yeah you just keep going that way you're ready to protect us from germany and yeah, one more turn. Ooh, we found a goodie hut. Oh my gosh, there was a goodie hut here this whole time. Let's go get that. Plus one envoy. Okay, we have an envoy we can put somewhere. And I'm going to put it in here. Wait, how do I do this again? Ah, I do it from the screen. So... Yeah, plus one science in the capital and in each library. That seems good. Yeah, so we were on seven science. Plus, so we were on four. We got the plus three from Pingula. Plus 15%. Plus one. So now we're on 9.1. Uh, and then plus 0 0.5 from our new city here. Okay, you can just fortify until the old because you actually have a little bit of damage. So here we have finished our holy site. And I want to build a shrine because it's going to give us great profit points. We're going to start getting our religion. No one has started earning great profit points yet. But some people have started earning great scientist points. So they have libraries up already. Damn, okay. Vietnam has a library. Got that. This. That also took us over the threshold for Dark Age. So we're on 12. We're going to have a normal age next age, which is good. Maybe we can get up to a, like a good age. Huh. Okay. So we found our city. We 
have finished our holy site and we're building a shrine. We stole this dude. We're going to go build a new city. I think that has been a productive episode. So let's end it here. I will see you guys next time. If you enjoyed this video, please leave a like and consider subscribing to the channel. And if you want to see more Civ 6, tune in next time. I've been the Maverick 427 and goodbye.